What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today's video, we're gonna be going over a funnel hacking method of a brand called Built Basics. I recently bought their shirts and they have since became my favorite t-shirt company on the market. Um, I ordered about $80 worth of product for this first initial funnel hack. And then I went back three days later and bought $300 worth of stuff. So kudos to you Built, great brand, great quality. Not only are your ads phenomenal, but so is your product. So thank you again for that. Stick around to the end of this video. We're gonna be going into the post purchase as far as their order, order Order confirmation page it appears they're using that new Shopify audiences feature uh, as far as sharing information on Shopify with other store owners and I found out something very interesting with, when it comes to their targeting it's a men's clothing brand primarily based on what their homepage looks like and what their ads are really catered towards even though they're getting into the female market now as well um, but something really interesting to notice I'll, I'll, I'll leave this little secret until the end of the video. So stick around, watch into the, the video. And if you are new here, my name is Opie. I'm an e-commerce growth specialist based out of Los Angeles, California. Uh, my goal on this channel is to help e-commerce brands scale their stores using tips, tricks, and tools we discuss and test on this channel. So if you get value from this video, please like and subscribe. As you know, we're living in an algorithmic world and this really does go to help the channel out so I can make more content for you in the future and buy stuff from really nice brands. So if you like this video, please again, hit like and subscribe and we'll get into it now. Greetings, friends. In today's video, let's get into the unboxing of this. Now, you know, I, I generally would probably just kind of tear this thing, but let's make a theatrical for the YouTube. I hope I don't cut open any packaging. But again, I, I decided to pick this brand based on their ads are phenomenal. I know that they're super successful at ads based on their ad spend. Um, and, you know, when you see a brand like this come along, I'm in the apparel space as well. It's just something that makes me want to buy it and hack their entire process. So again, I bought this a few weeks ago. Um, before that, I went into their abandoned cart sequence. I wanted to see what they were kind of putting out there to get me to re-engage, what kind of offer they would have in their email or SMS follow-ups. Um, I wanted to see what they're doing in their newsletter. And then after becoming a buyer, I wanted to see um, what their you know what their newsletter was like for past pur or for past purchasers, um, as well as kind of hack what their what their you know packaging was like. So here is their bag. It's a branded poly, um, obviously made out to me. Um, they have you know it's it's kind of like this little I guess you say like a navy color. Maybe this would be black, but navy. And then inside, I bought three T-shirts for their bundle deal. So this one's also in a poly bag custom built premium basics super nice here so i got a uh, two blacks and i think i got a yeah another black right here then i got my navy color right here all right so on the bag you'll notice it says built obviously the brand premium basics established 2016 and then this is for their pack and pick team um, to pull it and ship it out to us so really cool their website down here uh, built for life built for quality built for comfort Built for day, built for night, built for the gym, built for her, built for work. Yeah, great branding again, right? This is this is basically their avatar. What are, what what can I wear this shirt doing? Well, everything: day, night, morning, gym, travel, uh, last style. Um, this is just great, great branding. So, okay, cool. Let's go ahead and into well. All right, so other than that, this is the packing slip inside of the bag. They're not using some sort of insert. Um, Built, I don't know, bro. Where's your insert? Where's the welcome to the family? Where's my uh, incentive to come back and buy again? Where's my coupon for my next purchase? You're missing out, Built. You can learn a few things, watch the channel. Love your brand though. Um, all right, so opening up the bag. Let's see what we got. Oh man, this is, this is, this is really nice quality. All right. Super good quality. This shirt is just, I mean, the seams, it's got a little stretch to it, which I like. The seams are flawless. You know, as far as branding on the outside is great. And then on the inside, obviously, um, you know, this isn't some sort of, you know, t-shirt that just threw the little brand logo on. This is actually manufactured for them. Some cut and sew going on. The fabric is, is pretty unique to anything I've felt before. So they definitely stand out uh, amongst like what I'm wearing right now. This is a cheap cotton one I got for 18 bucks. On, uh, on Amazon, I think, and the seams are all off. The, the It's like a scalloped. On the bottom, you see here, it's kind of got that scalloped um, kind of curve on the bottom right there, if you can see that. So uh, 
you know, the ones I'm wearing now, it just, it's not the same. It's off to the side. It's really cheap, you know, really cheap poly cotton blend. You can see through it. It's not good at all. So I needed to up my, my game. I always, we wear black a lot on this channel. So that is the shirt. Uh, I, I, I love the quality of it. I can't wait to wear it this weekend, getting out of town. Uh, and then, yeah, let's get into their ad account. Let's get into their product page. Let's get into their post-purchase funnel. Let's get into their abandoned car sequences and SMS and all those good things that you're waiting to see. So I'll see you in the, I'll see you in the computer. All right, so let's dive into the uh, website first and kind of show you what this brand is. If you are unfamiliar, AKA have been living under a rock for the last few years. Um, this brand is all over the place. You can't get away from them once you view one ad or visit their website. They are constantly retargeting you. So let's talk about what this brand is. Built Basics, uh, Premium Basics. They sell everything from shorts, shirts, um, tank tops, pants, polo shirts. They do a drop cut shirt. They do regular t-shirts. Um, tons of offering here. They're definitely going after a male audience based on their home site here, our homepage. So you see here, they have some new shorts there's marketing, got some new arrivals down here, uh, outfit customizer. This is super huge when it comes to any sort of men's fashion brand and apparel brand. Men typically need a little bit of an extra boost when it comes to what's in trend. They wanna buy something that's in trend, something that they like, but they might need a little bit extra help as far as picking some items or apparel products that really meet, meet the look they're going for or what they're currently wearing. All right, so obviously here, outfit customizer, select top, select bottom, uh, get your new fit. Obviously this leads to an average order value kind of heightener, right? Or uh, an increase in average order values based on them buying not only a top, but a bottom. And then we scroll down here. They also have shoes now as well. Give 10, get 10. Give your friend $10 off their first purchase. So they have like a little incentive here as far as building a loyalty base. And they really do a good job um, on their website of presenting who this is actually for, right? You see tons of tons of uh, males being their number one audience right now. Uh, performance collection. This guy's obviously jacked. Um, they have a nice little uh, scroll here going through their new golf collection, right? This is for the active male, someone looking for some basics for the gym. We'll get a little bit more into that, uh, a little more into detail on that in the future. But really, any, if you're if you're a dude, no matter what you're doing, whether you're golfing, going out to clubs, whether you're looking for some new workout apparel, they really um, hit the nail on the head and target everyone. So really cool brand. Um, and then going through their um, their abandoned cart email sequence and post purchase email sequence, as well as getting their SMS for abandoned carts, uh, as well as post purchase. I've learned a lot about them and their marketing strategy. So let's go ahead and dive right into their ads library. And you can see what they're currently running. So right now they're running a site-wide 25% off offer. Um, those tees you like, the price just dropped. Get 25% off site-wise while supplies last. This one's catered towards pants. As we near the end of summer, you notice a lot of brands that are doing this massive site-wide sales, 25% up, 25% uh, off, all the way up to 75% off. Um, and this brand is no different. They're doing the same thing. They're liquidating a lot of their summer inventory, getting ready for their fall line to come out. So you'll see here, they have a really good mixture as far as a lot of video content. They're running the square, they're running portraits, as well as the, um, these appear to be kind of story placements or real placements. And everything they're running right now is just 25% off, right? So um, got some lifestyle video here. Here's a little more example on this pant they're selling, perfect for day or night, the Everyday Pant 2.0. Instantly elevates your look, right? Once again, they're kind of focusing on wear this day or night, um, and it elevates your look. So someone who's trying to be fashionable as well as comfortable, this is the brand for you. Ultra stretch, complete comfort, elite in fabric. These pants are game changers for your everyday wardrobe. Once again, everyday wardrobe, everyday wardrobe, game changers. And we kind of talk into their wrinkle free, four way stretch, wrinkle free, great. Why? Because who likes to do, um, <laughs> who likes to iron their clothes? Four way stretch material. They're catering towards a, um, you know, it's called built. They're catering, they're catering towards guys that are more uh, masculine as far as muscular and body structure. So when it comes to that core demographic, they're looking at the four way stretch material. It's super important because guys have big biceps, they got big quads. It's, tar it's tough to fit into Levi's skinny jeans um, if you're a bodybuilder, right? So this is kind of what their audience really um, has revolved around as far as their avatar goes. Tailored, slim fit, all new colors. Um, so yeah, as you see here, there's not much really going on as far as middle funnel and bottom funnel that I can see. I would go ahead and estimate that all of these ads that you're seeing right now are kind of targeting throughout their, throughout their Facebook funnel. These started end of July. This one's, uh, based on their Lux shirt. This is the one that I got. I, I love this shirt. It's amazing. It's thick. It's great quality. Introducing their shoes. 
This could be a, a middle funnel ad or a bottom funnel ad for cart abandoners, um, really leading in with a testimonial here and a five-star review. This really works well if people have visited your website but don't trust you enough just yet to make the purchase on day one. You can retarget them in the middle and bottom of funnel um, with this sort of messaging here in, in the form of a testimonial. Better fit, better fabric, and countless color options. Pretty straight and to the point. Again, they're going with this from the weekends at the fairway, casual Fridays in the office, complete your look, right? So again, they're going from the golf to the, the boardroom or golf to work, whatever you need. These, these are your everyday pants, right? Uh, some more ads going on down here. Level up your look. Find out why our basics have received thousands of five-star reviews. Again, they're quantifying, not just that they have five-star reviews, but there's thousands of these five-star reviews. A lot of video content here. So this is actually the, the bundle that I purchased uh, right here. The five item built bundle is here. Five item bundle, five shirts for $99. Um, I think this is actually a three, a three shirt bundle when I purchased it. Again, amazing offer, five shirts for $99. Like this is like the economies of scale as they produce more inventory, as they you know, ramp up their production, um, they can offer things like this because their value uh, as far as their cogs goes way down. So the more that they buy, the less their, their, their cogs are, cost of goods sold, and the better uh, discount that they can offer to you. So this not only at $99, it's a high average order value um, in comparison to a cost per acquisition or CPA, um, but it also probably breaks even on the front end for them um, with this bigger offer. And then, you know, you fall in love with not one or two things, but potentially five different items. So this is a great um, offer they're presenting here. Again, all these photos are really selling who this is for, whether you're, um, you know, looking at shoes, looking at shorts, looking at a polo shirt for the fairway, for the beach. This guy's got a little bit more, um, you know, they have the tattoo. It's not as clean cut as some of the other photos we've seen. Great ad here, kind of pointing towards all the different um, benefits of this product and the features of this product, right? So you see them highlighted up here. They're also listed down here showing you what these are. They got some female ads running now as well. $40 off, two shorts, another offer here. And this one is still active running since March 7th. So this is probably a really good ad for them if it's still running since March 7th. Again, perfect for day or night, everyday pant. And they go into the kind of uh, the, the benefits of the features of this pant. Same with this one going after the this bomber right here it is still active. So pro tip, if you're looking at ads that have been running uh, in someone's ad account, this one's still running from February 22nd of 2021, okay? So clearly these are probably really good offers or um, they've either been running since uh, 20, February 22nd of 2021 or they've brought these ad back, right? They brought it back. So for this end of summer season, they're relaunching it. This is probably a beginning of summer offer being in February. Um, but yeah, this really leads into, uh, leads me to believe that this ad is probably highly profitable for them. And again, you're seeing the same ad copy that you're seeing in the new ads, right? This better fit, better fabric and countless color options. So no matter what you are, if you're into dark complexion colors like myself, a lot of blacks, a lot of olives, things like that, or you're into some brighter stuff, they're showing you uh, on this little hanger image right here. Um, not only a great 40% off offer that they're including in the photo, uh, in the actual creative itself, but then they're also showing you a, a diverse collection of different colors, depending on what your fashion is uh, and what colors you like to wear. So. That's really it for their um, their ads library right now. We'll do an update video in the future on this and go into middle of funnel and bottom of funnel. But like I said, right now, this is heavily uh, sales season for most e-commerce brands, especially apparel brands. They're clearing out inventory of the summer selections and they're moving into their fall collection, um, which is a little bit different style and, and as far as fashion goes and fashion trend. All right, so let's dive into their website now and go over some things that they're doing really well and some things that I think even they could work on. Um, so here is the homepage. Obviously, um, they have a nice attention bar up top here showing off their free shipping on orders over 150. Then it goes into an offer they're running right now, five tees for $99, as well as 25% off site-wide summer sale. Um, they also have an affiliate offer going on over here, um, kind of building rapport and allowing you to earn dollars for every dollar your, your, your friends spend using your code. So give 10, get 10. Really leading focus into what their current offers are, premium performance collection, um, going into some nice collections over here, showing off again, some of their product lines on their tops. Outfit customizer, this is great. All right, so let's dive into one of their product pages now. Uh, I bought a drop cut shirt. I got this Lux one right here. Now on their product page, again, we wanna be sending most of our traffic to a product page or an offer page. In apparel, it's most likely gonna be a product page you're sending this traffic to. So important to have key elements here. 
Um, one being this header bar showing off your offers. So they have three offers. They have a, the five premium tees for $99. They're also showing on a 25% off site-wide summer sale, as well as their free standard shipping over 150. The give 10, give 10, um, $10 affiliate program or loyalty program. Um, and here you see really, you know, the regular price, $32 sale price, $23. They have their five star review count as well as 11,371 reviews. If you click on this, it actually goes down to the review section, which you want. You don't want to send them to another page. You want to keep them on this page. Um, so this is really great. Then they also have their color skews right here. Really quick loading, super important. 80% of your traffic goes right into the product photos. So. I love how they use this space to also incorporate this little video that goes over their UVPs, right? So, or, or, or uh, UVP, USP. So it's lightweight, ultra soft, no shrink, full way stretch. All the things, if you wanted to read, which most people don't, uh, they're listed down here. They include in this little video, knowing that their audience is gonna go directly to the image carousel, the product carousel, and look at these things, okay? So they have their core colors and then their summer colors. Summer colors meaning colors that do well in summer, you know, if you're going to the beach, if you're going to brunch, whatever it might be, summer activities, these are the colors that you wanna, you know, focus on if you want some, you know, some, some styling guide, if you will. All right, so super cool there. Size guide, super simple. A little video here also. This is great if you have um, issues with sizing. Some, you know, every brand has a different size uh, chart. For, you know, especially when it's when it's kind of cut and sew like this. So um, having a really clean, legible, easy to read um, sizing chart showing you exactly what their product, this product specifically is: body length, sweep, and then chest. Um, super important when you're figuring out what size you're going to buy. So that's really good to know. Going into their sizes here, quantities, select the size. Then we go down into their product description, level up your next look with a shirt that helps you look good and feel confident. This is great product features. So they're actually highlighting here. The model is six two, wearing a size medium. Then we're going again into some more features four way stretch, lightweight, no shrink. The same features we saw mentioned in that uh, video before completing the look with some other products, pants and shorts. This will help increase the average order value. And you have quick ad features right here as well, which doesn't lead them to another product page. It keeps them right here where they're at, uh, which is super important to really reduce friction in that customer journey. And then all these amazing reviews, obviously 11,000 reviews really speak for themselves. And they are using that program, Okendo, that we talked about in a previous video to pull the past buyers. So it says verified buyer here. And it actually asks them questions like, does it true to fit? Was the size correct? Uh, your size and tops is a match relatively similar to, you know, a large Nike shirt or a large Adidas. If you bought a large here, how does it fit compared? Same with bottoms. What's your body shape uh, as well as comfort, right? So you'll see here comforts five stars all across the board. Some of their sizing might not be true to fit, but it's all really based on how you wear your shirts. So they, they call this an athletic fit and it says a tailored look. So generally speaking, a tailored fit will be a little bit tighter. Um, and a little, you know, it'll highlight your muscles. That's kind of what they, they use this for the bodybuilding community, fitness people, things like that. So when you're mentioning that style cut, if you're looking for something that's a little baggier or box cut tee, this is not the shirt for you. So some of these sizing, um, discrepancies here, as far as like these four points right here, it might be relative to what people are buying. Um, like these threes right here, right? It might be because they're looking for a oversized fit or a boxier fit. And this is more of an athletic, slim, tailored look. So they have that here when you're helping make your buying decision and what size you might want, you're gonna look at these reviews and see what others are saying about the size. All of them are saying it's not necessarily two size. They say in this right here, they say the model is six foot wears a medium. This one says a model six two wearing a size medium. I can tell you I'm six foot wearing a large right now. Um, and it doesn't fit this way in my shirt. So this is interesting that they're saying, let's see what happens here. So they're using different models. I doubt they're all six foot two wearing a size medium. So that's something they're probably doing wrong on their page. You want to be very clear, you know, because if I'm six, two and I buy a medium and it's like up to my belly button, I'm not going to be a happy customer, right? I'm gonna have to return it. And it's a, it's just a, no one wants to return an item or exchange an item for a different size. So be as, you know, direct as possible and, and make sure you're congruent, right? You don't want to see a model of six, two, and then down here, the model is six foot. Like 
that's that's kind of off, right? We want to we want to make sure that whatever we're saying, you know, here is, is going to meet and match what we're saying down here as well. Um, but all in all, this is great. When you add something to your cart, so let's say I add this color forest and a large. We have a slide out uh, cart right here, or cart drawer as they call them. Um, add 126 and qualify for free shipping. And then also this little bonus down here. So if you spend $175 or more, you receive a free t-shirt. So they have an offer built into their cart drawer, super important, as well as an incentive to spend more money in order to get free shipping. I cannot tell you how many people that are shopping will break through this threshold for just to receive free shipping. This has a number to help increase your average order value. And it's the easiest way for any apparel store owner to increase their average order value is by adding this right in the cart itself. Also in the checkout section, you'll see this um, pop up again, this incentive. Once you type in this information, it'll give you again, add, add more to your cart, get the, get the extra value, get free shipping or get the, uh, the free promo. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy this and then we'll go into the, uh, the post-purchase stuff that I see as well. All right, surprise, wardrobe change. Uh, I had to film this at, later after realizing I didn't have any audio in the video. So I'm sharing a screen share right now with you and walking you through what I was talking about in this video. Um, but essentially, I saw something very interesting on the order confirmation page for Built Basics that I think I should share with you. It appears they're using the Shopify audiences plugin and the opted in for that, which means they're sharing real estate on their order confirmation page, showing the visitors uh, other brands that they might be interested in to help kind of share the wealth of that traffic and uh, directing traffic to another store that might be in a similar um, space as you or share the same customer avatar. So let me go ahead and pop this up. All right, so here is the order confirmation page for Built Basics. And I want you to notice is this is a, uh, a brand that caters towards men's apparel, right? Uh, over 80%, 85% of their market is men based on their ads alone. And they just recently introduced uh, women's apparel as well. But if you look at the brands that are under customers also shopped, right? It starts off with like very feminine brands, Remedy, Hydrant, Pelicase, Lilac, Cosmetics, right? And we keep scrolling down here. Uh, Jack Henry is a brand that's like male cosmetics, basically, our, our fragrances. Branch, Michael Todd Beauty, Fluffco, Moon Juice, right? A lot of women's cosmetics here, which is really interesting. If their avatar is men, this leads me to believe the people who are buying most from the website might be women buying for their man. All right, so I think what's happening here is very is very similar to what happens in Victoria's Secret. Now, most of the time, I think most of the majority in like the 90s and 80 of the purchasers of Victoria's Secret were men buying for their wives or girlfriends or someone else um, that they wanted them to look like the women you see on the runway for Victoria's Secret. Now, what's really interesting here is that they might be doing the same thing with their ads. They're actually targeting women with ads that have very athletic, very built, very uh, handsome men uh, in their creative, which leads me to believe that they're trying to, um, they use a lot of, you know, really buff masculine men that have, you know, their ribs, they have big arms, whatnot, handsome guys in their creative that they're probably targeting women to come and buy this for their man in the hopes that he will look buffer. He will look more jacked. He will look like he has bigger arms and a bigger neck and, and all those different things. Right? So it's kind of like the reverse play on Victoria's secret, whereas they were trying to get men to buy for the significant other. Uh, they're doing the same play with women trying to get their man to look like the guys in these photos and the guys that they use in all their creative are like, they're all jacked. They work out. They're athletes. Um, very similar to the runway models you see for Victoria's secret. Most of the women in America don't look like those models they are six foot tall. They're Heidi Klum's, things like that. So very interesting. If you do a brand hack of your own on someone's account, similar to yours, and you notice this and you're selling uh, mostly items to one gender, you might wanna switch the roles around a little bit and cater towards that gifting angle or give them um, the idea that they're buying this for their man to look like they're, you know, the guys in these photos. So that's my takeaway from this order confirmation page. I don't really want my audience uh, on our store going to other stores, especially if they're, you know, within a similar niche or something like that. But I think that um, we'll test it out and just see how much traffic we get in return and see if it's worth that value. Um, last thing you want is another shopper, you know, going to someone else's store. But this is the order confirmation page. I'd rather see a post-purchase upsell here, but 
uh, they're doing a little bit differently using the Shopify audiences feature of Shopify Plus. So let me know what your thoughts are on that. Well, who are they, who do you think they're catering? What does this mean to you when you see something like this? It might be a little bit you know, different than what you're seeing in their creative. All right, that's gonna wrap up today's video. Uh, in the link in the description down below, you will find access to a Google Doc that I created with their abandoned cart flows, their post-purchase flows, as well as the SMS uh, text that I've been getting from them since purchasing. So click the link below to get access to that and see how you can apply their strategy to your store.